Oh, what is good, everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play SpongeBob Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. I'm your guy, Ninja Killer 74, and let's get back into the mix. And we're gonna start off with the final full world, the Flying Dutchman's Graveyard, which has a fucking masterful track, um, a beautiful track, one of the best tracks on the OST for this game. Unfortunately, I'm going to be talking a lot, so you might not get to hear it that well, but I mean, I have the, the music up pretty, like, high at the same time, so. The graveyard of ships. Somewhere among this haunted mess, a fearsome specter waits. Alright, so here we are with the final world of this game. And we're going to start off by talking to the Blind Dutchman. Uh, uh, mm. Oh, <laughs> yes. Who dares disturb the Flying Dutchman? It's me, SpongeBob, sir. I don't need any cookies. But I'm not a shell scout. Look, kid, I'm too disturbed to scare the bejesus out of you right now. Come back later. What's the matter? It's these darn robots. They've thrown me off my own ship, they have. Being thrown off your own ship is like having your pants pulled down in front of casual acquaintances. It's a sad, sad thing. <laughs> now those robots have got their own pirate ship, and they're blasting away at each other. Is there anything I can do to make you feel better? Well, now that you mention it, get up to my ship and use the cannons to single-handedly defeat the robot ship. Any questions? Is that adorable hat available in a size three? No, but if you do uh. this, a golden spatula be your booty. Now get going. Oh boy, booty. Well, here's where we get an introduction to this new robot here. And there goes that guy. And he's gonna think SpongeBob did that. Because, of course! So, before we, he does anything, we're gonna take him out. Before he even Say gets a chance to, to shoot us friend. with his little oil rig. Goodbye! As you can see, we see text symbols. You know what that means! And over here. Uh, Sneak, 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 sneak. Get rid of these guys. Open that box right there. Hmm. Weird. Oh, what you look down there? There happens to be a golden spatula down there. Wonder how we get to that. I know how we're gonna get to that. <laughs> so we're gonna head over here. Hop across. Cross. Watch out for this Chuck right here. All right, we'll just take him out. There we go. I love opening presents. Oh, the music here is still fucking good. Okay. I'm gonna hit this. Come down here. We're gonna activate this. So now we activated that switch. So obviously that's gonna do something, but we can't do that yet though. What we are gonna do is we're gonna come back here. Hit this switch, and now we can wall jump up here. Terror and triplicate. And get rid of this guy. Now, what you want to do when you're over here is you see that little area right there with all that goo coming down, or whatever the fuck that is. You want to shoot it because that's gonna close that off. And somehow that drains the little uh, goop swamp that we got down here. And now that we've done that, we can come over here. Drop down there. And we can actually do stuff in this area. There's a spawn ball down there too. What can we do, you ask? Well, we can hit that switch. Turn the sponge ball. Get the rolling. Uh, I say get the rolling. Let's not hit shit on the way there. Just my size. Oops. Uh. I'm not gonna make it now. 
But yeah, we were supposed to roll all the way over here to get to this golden spatula. Unfortunately, I fucked up. So, we gotta go back up. No worries, nothing to this this can fix it. We can get we can stop this though right here. Let's get that out of the way. I mean I gotta worry about nothing else right there. There's a sock right there. One of the, our last three. Which all three are in this world down here. We can just hop right back down and restart. Woo! Alright. Let's not actually hit that uh that post this time. God damn it! Son of a fucking Okay, there we go. Around the bend. Getting a phone call. Uh, can I get this? Can I get this? Can I get this before my phone call? Oh, I got it. Sorry about that. Just got another phone call. Um, from my father. He just stopping and get get me some food or something. So. You know, I had to answer that. All right. Anyway, we're back here. And we're going to continue on the path now that we uh, got that gold spatula out the way. Now, I'm not entirely sure how somebody would just know this, by the way, because there's a gold spatula coming up here that I don't remember ever being keyed in or clued in on. Um, so we're going to come over here. I'm going to take out this chuck. Because I can. If you come up here, just randomly, I guess just to get maybe the shiny object, if you look down, there's like a ship down here, and if you jump down here, there's just a golden spatula chilling down here. I don't know what was supposed to clue you in on that, but I mean, hey, we got it though, so. And we can get back up easily because there's a trampoline over here, if you saw. Yep, enter to trampoline, hop up here. And it'll take you right back up where we at we were at. Okay. So what we need to do now is we need to get up here. So what we need to do is come over here. Uh let's knock this down here. Hmm. Actually this works out. This works out pretty well actually. We're gonna hit this. So now we can wall jump between those two. And we can hit this. Going up. We're up the top right here. We can go over here. Jump across. Jump right there. Jump up there. And we are up here. There's another chuck in here. You just we can get rid of him. I don't even think this guy even hit me. Well, he's gone now. So it doesn't matter. <laughs> you hop down here. Get rid of that. Get rid of that guy. And get rid of that guy. Nice. How are we doing with health? Oh, we need like to use a little bit breeze. after. Okay. So now we're going to hop over here. Across these uh, barrels or whatever they are. I'm gonna bowl like you out of here. Of We're gonna get rid of this mine. Like I did not mean to hit <laughs> that. Oh, so there's a. Jesus, fucking hell. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hang on. A split second. Whoop! You fucking asshole! These guys are really annoying right now, by the way. Get away! Oh my god! They spawn so quickly. Huh? It's because they spawn so goddamn quick in this version. Goodness gracious. Alright. So now we can come up here, finally. See, I wanted to continue on, but no. 
You guys want to be assholes, so you're all gonna die. I'm gonna stop this so you can stop respawning. And I'm gonna murder you all. We can't have nice things, can we? Now what you want to do is you want to come over here. And you want to hit the switch. What that's going to do. That's going to knock down this mast. And now we have a way to get across. So we're going to jump across here. Now when you go across here, it's going to slide you. Now we're going to open this box right here. We're gonna have to come back here with Sandy later on. I could walk the plank over there and get me uh, some underwear, but I'm not gonna worry about that yet. I love opening presents. We're just gonna continue on to the next portion of the level. All right, so now that we have that, I actually do know where the last Ahoy two socks there, are here. Mr. Squidward. Swab the poop deck. Yes, hilarious. Don't you have a oh, platinum whisk to uh, get? His laugh there. <laughs> platinum whisk. That's golden spatula. Whatever. There's one up there. I got Squidward's just done with the game now. He's like, fuck it, bro. Like this. I'm done with this shit. All right. So we're going to spin you out of here. And get you out of here. Now what you want to do is you want to be careful when you jump across these platforms right here. Because when you jump across them, they will go down. The controller will vibrate, so you know. Alright, we're going to keep it going across. Keep going across. And we made it over here. So we can switch to Sandy right now, but there's no need to right now. Besides, we have to switch to Sandy up here anyway. I don't know why they put a bus stop right there. I feel like a new sponge. Especially considering they give you a damn, uh... They give you a damn box there, so... There's no reason, even if you backtrack, to have to do that. But, uh, anyways, we're gonna go do this right here. We're gonna look around. And we're gonna get to swinging. By the way, I don't think I ever mentioned. I actually, uh... The I said earlier a good place to grind it was Gula Boom on top of that sandcastle, right? Well, it turns out there's an even better spot for you to do that, to grind for shiny objects. You can just head to Sand Mountain, and you can go to Guppy Mountain, where Mrs. Puff is, right? And you can just do her challenge over and over. There's our first sock right there of three. We know where the other one is at, but uh, can, can I actually make that jump from here? I don't know if I can. We're gonna try it. But you can go to Guppy Mountain and you can break all the uh, tiki's before you go down the, uh, the the fucking slope. But you can break all the tiki's before you go down the slope, and you can also um, well just go down the slope in general, break all the tiki's at the bottom, and you can just yeah, keep well, going it over and over, and you can get like an easy 1500. Uh, shiny objects that way each time you respawn. So, yes, you even want to hit the thunder tiki's on the way down because thunder tiki's do give you more uh, shiny objects than a standard tiki. Anyways, we're gonna switch back to SpongeBob now because we need to do some wall jumping, some timed wall jumping here, actually. So this is gonna push out, and we're gonna wait for it to push in. And since it starts pushing in, get the jumping. Hop up to the top, and we made it. So now we're gonna hop across here. Oh boy. Wow! Oh my god! What the hell? Uh, I don't know why I did that. Anyways, we can hop across here. You want to be careful on this one because... Unlike the... Oh, jeez! Okay, unlike the other version that we just did there, there is no floor. So... You want to be careful going across here. And you made it. Okay, we're going to take this guy right here out. Because we can. We're going to move. Headshot! Alright, so now that we're here, we're gonna jump across right there. 
push it, and jump across here. Uh, we're gonna activate you. We're gonna come, right, come over here. If we hop right here, and hop across, use this. We have a bungee, and in this bungee, right there, is a golden spatula. Number 80. We're getting so far. All right, now right here is another, uh, a bit more of a difficult one. So we're gonna wait for this to come all the way over here, right? We're gonna hop on, and we're just gonna jump across. Jump across. Jump across. There we go, easy. Come up in here. There's a Chuck right there. We can get rid of him. Uh. Fresh like a health. spring breeze. Oops. All right, we want to wait right here for a second and go. Wow, that's hard to do. This can take a few tries. It's a little bit tricky. Oh. No, I wanted to get a good jump. Damn it! Oh my goodness! Oh! Alright. Well, that's not the way it was intended, but we made it up here. We can get him out of here. I do take a lot of unnecessary hits, I'm not gonna lie. Anyways, now that we made it up here, what we're gonna do, we're gonna open this box right there. Oh, okay. We wanna go back. I see, I see now why there's a thing down here. So we're gonna come back over here, actually. We're gonna do this now, while we can. What I'm going to do is I'm going to actually end the part in a little bit. But first, we're going to jump across these uh, platforms. They do come back, don't worry. We're going to switch to Miss Sandra Cheeks. And now that we are Sandy, we are going to head this way. We're going to head back the way we came. Across we go. Keep pushing. And we're gonna go back to the first area where we saw the one sock. Because we're gonna get that sock now, so we don't have to come back at the end of the level and do it later. So here we have our little Texas swingy swingies. Our little symbols. And we can start swinging across. And once we make it to the end of this, we have our pin ultimate Ooh. sock. Do I really have to carry Patrick's socks? And with that, we can actually go back to where we were at with the uh, getting to the top here in the last area. We can just ride the taxi, take the box to get back up to the top. Oh, and it, look at that! Switch to back to SpongeBob. Just what I needed. We're gonna get back up here to the top. And we're gonna come over here. And this should take us to the Flying Dutchman ship, which we are going to start in the next part. So I'd like to thank everybody for watching, to my brothers and sisters and everybody else in between. And I will see you in the next one when we try to take back the Flying Dutchman ship. Later.